is that? Woo! Oh, a oh, oh, what? Pollock. The pollock. Yeah, pollock. Take, take this one here, Ron. <laughs> this is a game uh, fish, actually. Yeah. It's a rod. It's a rod. Okay, I got it. I got it. It's gorgeous. That's a great fish. Huh? It's really gorgeous. Yeah. Nice pollock. Uh, oh, oh no! Ah! Did you see him? <laughs> that was a nice fish. <laughs> right there. Oh, yeah, I didn't it, see it was so nice. This is my fifth time, Ron. Now keep in mind that we are catching these fish in this particular spot between 260 and 300 feet deep. Now for those of you that are wondering, yes, that is my youngest daughter, Keenan. She is the Director of Public Relations and helps me answer all those phone calls I get from you folks every week. And I wanted an 80 pounder. Yeah, yeah. All right. <laughs> if you follow that, baby, when you follow Oh, my goodness. Ooh. Oh, shit. Nice fish. Oh, Thank you. But it's another keeper, okay? Mark, I can hang. I gotta show him. <laughs> Who was our first? The professional fisherman, the uh, professional football player. Yeah. Well, I still say fishermen are just that. Real men. You caught me so far, because I don't know. That's what they look like. Yep. 
Don't take too many of these to make a dozen. <laughs> yep. we're, getting, we're getting close to the gear. We gotta pull up. Pull them up. Okay, yeah. Pull them up. I, I think we're gonna trip. Couple is I'm not sure. We should be on the south side of it. Yeah, reel them up anyway. Oh, we got to put him out there. There's my fish. There he is. Yeah. He's another nice one. Just cut it. Come on, Monday. Come on, no mistakes, but that's my gravity guard. Yeah. And this is the beef gravity show. Yep. Oh, look at that. How much is this? Oh, jeez. Got one ready to come up, Tom. Yeah. Oh, Nelly! You look like I get doubled off. Yeah, I might have to double header. One of them to stay. No. Oh my God! Look at my stupid fish. Oh, I'm in trouble. Oh my God! Let me help you. <laughs> Now I'm at the black street. Get right down there, you got it. That's the way to do it. Oh! No, no. <laughs> 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 Thank you, thank you. I thought you was helping. Listen, this is the fish of the day, Mark. I'm telling you. Think so? Yeah. Uh, this is it. I'm telling you. I think some of the uh, plays that I, I really enjoyed and, and playing against some of those players is uh, playing up against uh, someone that was thinking all the time. Uh, that was able to maneuver and, and, and try to get around me. And, and that person happened to be Steve Largent. You know, he wasn't the fastest guy in the world, but he was thinking all, all the time. And I guess that's why he's a politician now. But uh, uh, for instance, you know, he would look back at the quarterback, you know, and throw his hands out like he's going to catch the ball. So you put your hands inside his hands and look back to see if the ball is coming, and then he turns around and goes the other way. So uh, he kept me thinking all the time. He was a tough competitor. Um, I've seen him make a hit on a couple of guys, man. It was, it was fantastic hits on linebackers that intercept the ball. Well, that's payback. Yeah, well, that's, that's, <laughs> that's payback. And, uh, you know, my uh, memory of uh, uh, coming up against Herschel Walker was... Um, you know, that was one, one of my down times where I was knocked out. I, I didn't want to hit him up top because he has uh, uh, great upper body strength. Yeah, he's a big boy. So I decided that I was going to try to cut him and, I, and uh, hit him up too high around his thigh area, which is pretty, pretty big also and strong and, and powerful and end up knocking myself out. I remember going, uh, waking up on the sidelines and saying, what the heck am I doing here? <laughs> and... Uh, you know, I'm ready to get back in the game. And they told me, sit down, sit down. The doctor came over and he said, uh, Ronnie, what, what quarter is this? And I tried to look up and see what it was. And he stood in front of me and I said, uh, third quarter. He says, yeah, what? Well, you, you sit down some more because it's only the first quarter. <laughs> <laughs> game just started. Yeah, game just started. This is going to be a long day for me, I remember. Oh, no. You see him? What? Stop. You reel him? Woo! Oh, oh yeah! All right. Hey! You like that guy? You're the biggest Oh, one. yeah. He's the biggest one. Yeah. Yes, he oh, is. Oh, most definitely. Look at that That's puppy. the one. We're going to cut something. Tail, you want to sure. jump in his tail, huh? It's, uh, oh, yeah, put MB. <laughs> <laughs> it's a tuna! <laughs> 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 
Now, over the years, I've been asked so many times why the majority of my guests are NFL players. It's not just because they're good friends of mine, but they're real sportsmen and true competitors. Oh, this is a nice one. Oh, bigger than yours. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> this is huge. I think I got the big one so far. Yeah. Woo! Dang it. Holy you cow. You have to fight over here. Ah, Mel, what are you? Oh, you, uh, I helped you bring him in. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank yeah, you very much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All donations accepted. <laughs> wow, nice. look how yeah. big that joker is. Nice fish. Nice fish. Yeah. It's a competition now. Yeah. It's two different sports, sports athletes, the best in their field, Come on. competing against each other. Because I know I'm one of the greatest fishermen in the world. Uh, Ronnie, Ronnie used to be one of the greatest football players in the world. Come on. Come on. Now it's just a matter of which one is the best. Well, I'm going to have to change over with this fish. I'm going to have to get a bigger rod, huh? Yeah. Ronnie, what position do you play? Left out? Left corner? Left out? No. Left out? No. Left corner. <laughs> Now, right, 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 right